one of the, they were all super goals, but Richie, this Dzeko goal, the goal that made it 2-2, we'll be seeing this for years. It's fab. It was a wonder strike, and one thing we all commented on when it went in was just how similar it was to Van Persie's strike for United at Old Trafford a few years ago. Wonderfully timed run, to the power in the shot, the accuracy, the control, it pulls away from the defender, opens up his body, nothing whatsoever the goalkeeper can do about that, just wonderfully struck. Brilliant, brilliant goal. And as well, like Duffer said, he, he like well, getting the two goals is great, but he, he had a hell of an opportunity to win it at the end from what was a really, really far easier opportunity than that one there. Davey, looking at, at Conte and, and, you know, the, the success he had last year and this re repeated comment about the squad being on the thin side, Matic going, he wanted other players brought in the summer and stuff like that. Like, what's your read about how that will play out? The An Ancelotti thing, he's a former manager, people, w w we all added two and two together and came up at 28 with him there tonight. <laughs> but, you well, know. I don't think Angelotti is the type of manager who goes there and no, uh, and I'm not to, suggesting that for a and, minute. And tries but. to nick the the yeah. job of his uh, fellow countrymen. Um, it's very strange because I think well, I, I never gave him a chance last season, and I think what they did last year was was sensational to win the league. Obviously, without European football, yes, the squad was thin, but then again, he probably didn't need a, a big squad because obviously, the more people you have, uh, they haven't got that many games. The more unhappy players you've got, they need it new players in this this year i think they they signed two or three uh, they lost matic will be here against the will of the manager who didn't want to sell him to manchester united um and i don't know what the expectations are because um they did ever so well to win the league last season obviously expectations are higher but the eye in the champions league is still in a fantastic position sure. in a tough group with roma atletico got seven points so you expect them to go through um in the league they're stuttering a little bit and um I don't know what, the, what, what Abramovich wants, whether he uh, wants a new manager every other year, whether he wants to take part in, in, in uh, transfer policies, whether he wants to take part in, in picking the team, um, because I don't think any other manager could have done what Conte did last year. Richie? I, I don't have any sympathy with Conte. We, I think we spoke about this in match day two, mm -hmm. actually. I, I, if he's unhappy that with the decisions that other people are making about the, the building of the squad, players coming and going, he would have known well in advance of taking that Chelsea job that that's a structure at the club and he could have easily found out if he didn't. Um, and, and there seems to be a trend now. Mourinho did it recently. A journalist wrote an article saying Mourinho was unhappy with Ed Woodward and, and his, his handling. Um, it seems to be a thing now. Managers are coming out complaining to try and shift the responsibility elsewhere in the club. But... Conte knew what he was taking on before he took the job. And stuff for set, they've umpteen players out on loan. If the squad's too small, bring them back. Okay.